morning, everyone. Tammy Trier, TrierWilderness.com. It's been quite a while since I've jumped on here and actually shown my face. You've seen, heard maybe some of my podcasts, and you probably w heard my uh, black-screened live video the other day. It didn't go very well, needless to say, but I was on there. And uh, I've been busy uh, doing some live Facebook uh, videos for the month of August for a pre-preparedness month challenge uh, focusing on health and fitness uh, but it's been a character building year to say the least for us we are doing well I am as you can see certainly improving and I am thanking God every day for that I progressed very slowly up until about July and then things shifted pretty good for me I'm still I still have my struggles and I will have another probably Oh, probably a year of treatments, but I'm doing very well. My body is bouncing back, and I am very blessed to say the least. Uh, June, up until June, I was doing a lot of sleeping. I couldn't get out of bed any before 10, 30, 11 o'clock, and when I tried, my eyes would just roll up in my head. My body was uh, definitely in need of rest, so that's what I was doing. I've been catering to my body and have slowed down tremendously uh, for me and it's been a blessing I'm very grateful and part of my protocol is walking so I have been walking and walking and walking I walked about 73 miles one month 83 the next in July we had a stressful month and I used that time wisely and I walked 115 miles which kept my body f from uh, hanging on to the excess stress and it has been good to me it has catapulted me um, as I mentioned in uh, the video that the mountain man and I did I had gone from lifting 85 pounds on my weight bench to not being able to pick up a ball canning jar with a quarter full of oatmeal so it was really a very difficult time for me it was mentally challenging for a while but God helped me through that and I've been blessed to have such good and wonderful friends and prayer warriors out there for me and God God is leading the way God is taking very good care of us uh, the mountain man and the mountain boy started a job um, towards the middle of June um, with Treyer construction and they are putting an addition on a home which is starting to wrap up but we had gone for roughly about six and a half months without an income while I was very sick and he was caring for me. So it has been definitely a character building year and we've recently found out that our insurance company is not paying a penny of my medical needs. So again, we are just rolling with it. God is leading the way and God is, uh, has definitely given us some direction as of recently and we have made the decision to sell our off-grid homestead. We are going to sell the place that we've put a lot of sweat, blood and tears into and we are going to purchase another piece of raw land and we are going to start from the bottom up again and we will be certain to take you along for the journey even more so than we did on the on the first run of things and uh, we're going to live a lot simpler even simpler than we are now and uh, I feel I feel very blessed uh, and I'm excited about our adventure. It will be certainly that, and there are a lot of unknowns, but the one solid thing that we have to stand on is is that God is leading the way, and we know that. So I know we will be taken care of, and um, it may not be easy all the time, but we learn to roll with it and and persevere and end up on the shiny side. So, and I wanted to mention for those of you that had. Uh, submitted questions and had uh, questions regarding my illness. If I did not answer everyone, please feel free to email me at ask, A-S-K, at treyerwilderness.com. And if you are interested in um, information on our homestead, you can email us at homestead at treyerwilderness.com. And uh, I just feel truly blessed uh, to be alive and I feel truly blessed to be um, healing in such a, uh, an amazing way. I've been doing a lot of different treatments. You can go to our website at treyerwilderness.com and you will find a post on all the symptoms and, and the varying things that I had gone through. Uh, for those of you that might know others that are suffering or you may be suffering yourself, it will give you a basis on where to start. And I will be putting a post out on my protocol to also help other people progress through this because 
this is one nasty illness that uh, really wreaks havoc on the body so it is really important to get the toxins out of your system I've been doing a lot of deep muscle therapy I was doing that uh, every week and now I've progressed to every other week but that has been amazing for me and I just wanted to share that with you um, you can look for a new post on our website every Wednesday my podcast will be out every other Wednesday at this point and we will be consistently putting videos out here on our channel moving forward. I have a lot of old videos that I did not have the strength to edit and I apologize. So you will see the mountain man coming soon. He's like I said, he's been busy putting an addition on a home. But he has a lot to share and there's a bunch of old videos that I need to edit and get out to you. The other thing is I'm going to merge our mountain woman journals and mountain man journals onto this channel so everything is at one place so stay tuned for those as well for those of you that are new to the channel you'll be able to see some of um, our beginning work and um, educationals and today I wanted to just um, take a pause here and ask those of you that are our prayer warriors to keep uh, one of our own another off-gridder also here in Idaho in your prayers. Some of you may be familiar with her channel here on YouTube, Starry Hilder. And if you're not, uh, I made a quick and easy link. You can go to treyerwilderness.com slash S-T-A-R-R-Y-H-I-L-D-E-R, Starry Hilder. Or you can just search here on YouTube. But I'm going to be doing and I have been doing other live videos and I've been uh, presenting that so that people can quickly find her. She is another kindred spirit. She is a, uh, another woman of faith. I am just so, I wouldn't be where I am without the help of God at this point. God carried me through uh, an illness that I almost lost my life to. And Starry has an extremely deep faith as well. And I feel very connected to her. I've never had the privilege of meeting her, but I hope sometime in the near future I can. They're only about three or four mile, uh, hours north of us. And... Uh, she was riding her mountain bike and going at a very fast speed on macadam and a stick got in her spokes a couple days ago and her, she was thrown from her bike. She has a broken neck and a broken back and she has a lot of facial damage, broken teeth and, and but her spirit is, is just tremendous. Um, I really have a lot of respect for her. Um, it just broke my heart listening to her video that she put out yesterday. but. I know she will be just fine because she's putting her faith in God and that's where it's all at you know he's our rock for those of us that are Christians uh, I totally I totally get where she's at I know she's gonna have struggles mentally at some point as she progresses and and is limited but that's where our prayers come into play and that's the best gift we can ever give anybody is to offer a prayer for them on her YouTube channel though there is the opportunity to donate and if you feel led I do highly encourage that because as within our situation if it hadn't been for my dear friend Vicki Lynn starting a fundraiser for us we would have been in a a very rough spot and we were very blessed to have the funding that we needed to get to Georgia for my surgery so I encourage you to lend a hand if you are able but pray for them pray for them regularly and um, she is trying to put updates on her channel as to how she's progressing but God love her she's just got such a sweet soul and she's putting her faith in God and I think that the least we could do is just lift her in prayer and her husband as well because folks that was one of the hardest things for my mountain man and my mountain boy was watching me decline and watching me in poor health and not being able to fix me men are fixers and to have to sit on the sidelines while you heal is very difficult so please pray for them and pray for their caregivers uh, she is a nurse and her friends um, were in the ER caring for her and they are caring for her now taking turns caring for her in this in this time so again you can find her at treyerwilderness.com slash starry hilder and um, folks we will we will see you again soon but just lift them and um, love love them and uh, definitely go over and subscribe to their channel they've got a lot of great materials again like I said they live off grid as well and are kindred spirits they uh, put their faith in God and and have a tremendous channel there so 
Thank you for your time this morning. I really appreciate you guys. I look forward to communicating with you. Would love to hear from you. Leave me a comment. How are you guys doing and what have you been up to and, and look forward to sharing new videos with you soon. So take care and until our next video, God bless.